This video is sponsored by AppMaker. AppMaker is a WordPress plugin that converts WooCommerce websites to mobile apps. The mobile app builder helps you create native Android and iOS application. Hello everyone and welcome back to the new video of Educate WordPress. On this channel we talk everything about WordPress and today we are gonna see a plugin which can help you embed a PDF file directly onto your website without going through any trouble of editing it or uploading it or typing the contents of a PDF on your website. So let's see how you can do it using a simple plugin called PDF Embedder. So first you have to go to your dashboard. and go to plugins and click on add new and we'll search for pdf here and this one pdf embedder we are going to use it by wp pdf embedder team click on install now and after installation you have to click on activate Now you will see PDF Embedder in settings. Here it is. So to go to PDF Embedder settings, you can go to settings and PDF Embedder. And this is its settings. You can choose the width and height of the PDF that you want to include. And the toolbar location, toolbar hover, and display option. This is available only in premium version. So you have to buy its premium pack. And this is mobile friendly embedding. So you can save the changes here. You can use this premium version so that it does not have any difficulty with smaller screens also. And in secure you can include PDF embedder secure also. But you have to buy premium package for it. And this is the about section of the plugin. And now let's see how it works. So simply we'll go to a post. And create a new post here. And give it a title like example PDF. And here, what I'll do, I'll simply click on add and search for PDF. So it will show me PDF embedder. I click on it and here I will click here again and upload the PDF file. So like I can upload any file here. So now I have included a file here. So if I click on preview. It will take some time to load the PDF. So this is the PDF file. I can see it simply here embedded. I can see the page one and two option here. Since it has only one page, showing me only one. If as if it has different pages, I can add a option to slide it to move to different page. So now to replace this file with another file, I can either remove the PDF here. Or click on this icon and select the file again. So now, if I refresh my page here after including different PDF, it will show me, and I can go to different pages by moving this icon. Option to view in a scroll mode, you have to buy its premium package. You can click on zoom in and zoom out also. So this is how it will look. You can directly include any PDF here. You do not have to go through any settings. So that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button if you like this video and subscribe to Educate WordPress.